The Goonies has become one of those cult classic films that people re-watch over and over again and if you're one of those you likely know all the characters and their lines by heart, but you might not know what the cast is up to now. It's been 38 years since Steven Spielberg's movie first came out, which follows a group of children who call themselves the Goonies as they go on a hunt for the treasure of legendary pirate, one-eyed Willie in the good docks of Astoria, Oregon. The film starred actors such as Josh Brolin, Sean Astin, and Kei Hui Kwong when they were just kids. They've all come a long way since then. So here's a look at where they are now. Sean Astin, Mikey, Sean was just 13 when he made his film debut as Mikey in The Goonies and has now 52. Since starring in the film his career has flourished, with him appearing in Disney's The Bee. R.E.T. Patrol, as well as The War of the Roses and Whitewater Summer with Kevin Bacon. In the early 2000s he won the part of Samwise Gamgee in the Lord of the Rings films and received a number of award nominations for the role, winning five including the Saturn Award and the Sierra Award. Following this he released a memoir about his career, called There and Back Again and starred in Adam Sandler comedies like Fifty First Dates and Click. Has gone on to become a producer and director as well as an actor and has done voiceover work, voicing Raphael in the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles animated series on Nickelodeon. Most recently has appeared in Stranger Things, The Big Bang Theory and Brooklyn Nine-Nine. The actor has three daughters with his wife Christine Harrell, who has been happily married to since July 1992. Josh Brolin, band, Josh shot to fame in his younger years thanks to his role as Brandon Brand Walsh in The Goonies, Mikey's older brother. After starring in this he was considered for the role of Tom Hansen in 21 Jump Street, although Johnny Depp eventually nabbed the part. His career stalled a little between 1990 and 2006, with the actor having small movie roles and parts in TV shows, which were unfortunately cancelled. As such had had to find another way to make money and by 2006 he was trading stocks full-time when he finally got a leading role in the Coen Brothers film No Country for Old Men, which ended up being a huge hit and won Academy Awards has since starred in American Gangster, Milk, True Grit, Men in Black 3, Deadpool 2, Dune and as the big baddie in Avengers, as Thanos in Guardians of the Galaxy, Avengers, Age of Ultron, Avengers, Infinity War, and Avengers, Endgame. In his personal life, Josh was previously married to actress Alice Adair from 1988 to 1994 and the pair have two children. He was then engaged to Minnie Driver for six months, before marrying Diane Lane in 2004. The pair divorced in 2013, has since married his former assistant and model, Catherine Boyd, and the pair have had two daughters together. As well as famous wives, the actor also has a very famous stepmother, as his father James Brolin is married to Barbara Streisand. Jeff Cohen, Chunk, Jeffrey Burton Cohen played clumsy Chunk in the Goonies movie and went on to star in the Disney TV movie, Ask Max as well as Scooby-Doo and the Ghoul School and Perfect Harmony. As he got older, he used his Goonies movie connections to get summer jobs working on the business side of film at movie studios before retiring from acting completely and heading to law school. The 49-year-old now works as an entertainment lawyer and notably negotiated the deal of his former Goonies co-star, K. Hui Kwan for his role in Everything Everywhere All at Once. Kna thanked Cohen in his Oscars acceptance speech, calling him his Goonies brother for life. Corey Feldman, Mouth Corey's acting career began at age three when he appeared in a McDonald's advert, 
He went on to appear in over 100 TV ads and 50 TV series in his younger years, including Mork and Mindy and Cheers. After Goonies, he appeared in a number of other iconic 80s movies including Gremlins, Stand By Me, and The Lost Boys. Sadly, Corey fell into drug addiction in his teens after winning legal emancipation from his parents, who he accused of abusing him physically. He also befriended Michael Jackson around this time. His career then suffered a six-year setback when he was caught possessing heroin, and he struggled to get back to the glory days of his fame. He went on to appear in a number of reality shows, including Celebrity Wife Swap and Dancing on Nice. In November 2017, shortly after the hashtag MeToo movement started gathering pace, Corey alleged that he and his late friend Corey Heim were passed around to Hollywood pedophiles when they were children. And in 2018 he tweeted that he had been stabbed while out in public. The actor took pictures of himself in a hospital bed and revealed the attack happened while his security guards were distracted. He said three men approached him while he was out in public, before another man pulled up in his vehicle. Outside of this in his personal life, Corey was previously married to actress Vanessa Marcel from 1989 to 1993. He then married actress and model Susie Sprague, and the pair share a son. Has since married his longtime girlfriend Courtney Ann Mitchell in Vegas in 2016. K Hui Guan, Data, K Hui Guan, who is also known as Jonathan K Guan, is well known for his acting roles in his youth, starring in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom alongside Harrison Ford as well as his part in The Goonies. And since then the 52-year-old's career has been interesting. After success in these parts, he took a 19-year break from acting, instead working as a stunt choreographer and assistant director. However, he returned to acting in 2021, starring in Finding Ohana before joining the cast of Everything Everywhere All at Once for which he won an Academy Award, a Golden Globe and a Screen Actors Guild Award. The movie star is married to Echo Guan, who worked on Everything Everywhere All at Once as a translator. As well as being a talented actor, he also has a black belt in Taekwondo. Carrie Green, Andy, Carey starred in a number of teen movies in the 80s as well as The Goonies, including Summer Rental and Lucas. She took a break from acting to attend college before getting back into it in the 90s, appearing in independent film and guest starring on TV shows. However, she went on to get behind the camera, co-founding a production company called Independent Women Artists with Bonnie Dickinson. Outside of her career, she's married and has two children. Martha Plimpton, Steph, acting has always been in Martha's blood as her parents were both actors, Keith Carradine and Shelley Plimpton, who met while performing together in the original run of the Broadway show Hair. As well as appearing in The Goonies, the 52-year-old garnered fame for her parts in Shy People, Parenthood, Samantha, Raising Hope, The Good Wife and Frozen 2. She's also starred in numerous Broadway productions, following in her parents' footsteps. In the 80s she notably had a romantic relationship with River Phoenix, but things ended with a pair in 1989 due to his substance abuse. John Matushik, Sloth, the misunderstood character of Sloth in The Goonies, who ultimately befriends the group, was played by John Matushik, whose career initially started out in football, as he played in the NFL. He later became an actor, retiring from the sport after winning his second Super Bowl in 1981. 
After starring in The Goonies, John had a number of acting roles in film and TV in the 80s, including appearances in Miami Vice, One Crazy Summer, The Ghost Rider, and Hollywood Beat. The actor sadly died in 1989 after an accidental overdose of a prescription medication, he was 38 years old at the time. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.